Hey what's up you guys, welcome to the video. It's been a little bit since I did a review and I'm just in the mood to review a product that I've tried. We're gonna review 19 Crimes Wine. Um, this is a product of Australia and it clocks in at 13.5% alcohol by volume. Um, I picked this up for eight dollars um, at my local grocery store you could you could see it anywhere between eight and like eleven dollars for um for the liter depending where you are so we're gonna go ahead we're gonna pour this into my trusty beer mug because I don't have a wine glass to pour this into so we're just gonna pour a little bit in there Give it a smell. It has a very sweet, pleasant smell to it. Sometimes when um when a wine is very dry, you um you don't pick up as much of the scent from the grapes and the berries that are mixed in with the wine. But this one has a very pleasant smell. It's not overbearingly sweet, but um, you definitely smell the grapes and other various things that make this sweet. So now we're gonna go ahead and give it a taste. I like this a lot. It has um, a very sweet start to it, but it goes down dry. I, I personally like um, wines that are a little bit on the sweeter side. Um, if you don't like wines that are su sweet, you might not like this. But this is, this is very drinkable. I could definitely see myself buying this again in the future. Um, it's very easy to write a product like this off because it's very gimmicky like with the prisoner in the front and um, each cork has like one of the 19 crimes written on it. It is a very like gimmicky product but don't let that deter you from um, trying this product out because it is tasty um if you are like one of those wine connoisseurs maybe this isn't for you but like if you're the average joe which like most of my viewers are and you need you want an affordable bottle of wine that's good 19 crimes is a good bottle you could have this with dinner, you could bring this to cocktail parties, you can, you know, just sit, have a glass and relax. Is there probably better wines out there? Yes. Does that make this wine bad? No. Especially for $7. Like, you can't go wrong with uh, 19 crimes at that price tag. You can't go wrong. It's smooth, it's drinkable, and very affordable. Don't let the gimmick deter you from trying this one. I don't drink wine very often. I don't drink alcohol very often. But uh, if I feel like grabbing a bottle of wine, I will definitely pick up 19 Crimes Wine again. And um, I'm going to rate it for what it is. It's a budget wine. Like um, a Barefoot and a Yellowtail and Rex Goliath. I'm going to give this a solid 9 out of 10. Very good. This 100% gets a wood recommend out of me. 
So yeah, thank you all for watching. If you're over 21, go out and try it. If you're 21 or over, go out and try this product. If you try this product, please try it responsibly. And I'll see you on the next video.